Opening the OGL widget displays all help and support available within the Oracle system, based on the role or roles of the user who is logged in. The top section, Getting Started, contains relevant information to help getting started with Oracle. Below this the interactive process guides are listed, grouped into sections. The buttons on the left-hand side can be used to filter the content of each section and find the required item. When viewing the complete list, if we scroll down we can see links to additional resources, such as training courses. For this demonstration we are going to request the setup of a new supplier, using the process guide request supplier registration. Each process guide starts with the navigation from the home page to the relevant functional page. In this case, there are further instructions to navigate to the appropriate task within the menu related to supplier activities. This example contains an introductory message, which sets the scene and provides information about prerequisites, and also explains what happens after this task. The message can also be used to remind users to watch out for smart tips and flashing beacons for more detailed instructions or further information while working through the process. The next process guide step provides instructions for completing the fields in the top section of this page. Here we can see several examples of smart tips, the color has been customized so that they stand out and look different from the standard Oracle help icons such as the one next to the page name. Some smart tips provide critical information to ensure correct data input. Others facilitate the selection of appropriate values, such as this tip on the supplier type field. Notice in this tip there is also a hyperlink to access a form that needs to be completed at this stage of the process. When all information has been completed, click the next button. The next step is to complete contact information. Note the smart tip in this pop-up window. These fields are not marked as mandatory by Oracle, but the tip advises that we must record at least one phone number. When all information has been completed, click the OK button as instructed. The next step is to add addresses. Note that these additional steps contain back and next buttons, in case it is necessary to add more than one contact or more than one address. We could thereby repeat a step in the process if necessary, and control the advancement of the guide while we do so. Here we see some more smart tips, providing assistance to complete the address details. When the address information is complete, the final instruction is to link the contact before clicking OK. The next step is to add products and services, following the instruction provided. Before submitting the request, we must check that all information has been completed. The smart tip next to the register button provides a checklist as a warning that the approver is likely to reject the registration or request further information if it is incomplete. Once we have checked this, we can click register to complete the process. A message advises that the process has been completed and includes a reminder of what happens next. We can now click the done button to close the guide. 